All right, that's not bad. Oh my god, four hundred dollars for a lightsaber. That is redonkulous. All right, what is this? Taki doki, toki doki. Oh, you know what? I can see the prices right up there. Look at that, two forty for a skateboard. I didn't realize that. I've been going through everything. I can just see the prices right up there. Underneath it. Oh, shit. Do something, almighty. Oh! Oh! Ripping it. And he flipped it up. Push your shirt. Let's see. Different skateboards. Same price. 240 Tees, 80 Hats. So, hats, 80 Shirts, 80 If it's a sweater, I guess it's going to cost more. Because the Gears of War sweater was more. Bioshock. Bioshock's probably going to get some big downloads. Um... Are you kidding me? 240 Microsoft points for your character to hold a big daddy doll. Oh my god. Bioshock shirts. 80 points. Helmet. 160. That's not bad for helmet. The helmet should drop a little bit. I, I think everything's overpriced right now. Fucking ambulance, oh my god. I think everything's a little bit overpriced right now, but... What the hell does this shit say? Make a statement with the prototype Big Daddy T. 160, 80. Demo. I, I don't play Bioshock. Part 2 looks hot. Multiplayer. Since they add multiplayer, Almighty will get it. They gotta have multiplayer. If not, I will not buy it. So, two helmets... 160 that rag doll for 240 is just stupid so that's the premium content maybe they have more but you guys could check that out on your own i'm gonna save and edit actually let me take a game picture so everybody can see hell yeah right there jenna let's see Wait, oh man turn the wrong way you motherfucker how do i take a picture damn i'm gonna take a picture forever a eh? You like that, Jim? Let me see. I gotta move the camera over a little bit. Yeah, I know. You made me feel dumb when I was like, yo, I bought 80 points. This shit's hot. You are like, no. Alright. I think this one's a good angle. I think that's good. I will take it. Change picture background. Alright, that's good. Oh, the picture background. Uh, I'll leave it as. Oh, the red one looked hot. For the Gears of War. Red symbol. There you go. And I will exit. Yes, keep it. Alright, that looks legit. Alright, so let's save and exit. Almighty shopping spree is done. Hell yeah. Yo, Team D. Alright, so. Oh man, I got all thrown off by that shit. I was supposed to fucking be showing you guys the new dashboard. Alright, so. We're gonna have, yeah, I started buying shit. Um, so, there's gonna be actually a bunch of different updates. Um, they're gonna have, we talked about purchasing brand new games. Uh, download full games. Or right onto your Xbox, which is pretty hot. Um, another issue people had playing and sharing. Uh, let's see what it says here. As with other live content, your game licenses license is linked to your Xbox Live account. Download your purchase games to any console you are logged into with your gamer tag, and anyone else can play on that console with your game was originally downloaded too. No disc, no physical disc is required to play these games. So, which means before you could only play the game that you downloaded to the xbox it was downloaded at which a lot of people were upset about because if something happened they brought their xbox to their friend's house just their hard drive and they tried to download a game it wouldn't work so now no matter which xbox you go to i guess you do a recover account you're able to play the game right there which is pretty good um so let's see everybody's online oh my team's in a party addy who is that clunk jizzy um we're gonna have for the new updates they also talk about, uh, let's go down here, let's go down here, your parties. Everybody loves to party. Check out the new and improved 
party reconnection and streamline party invites. Um, party reconnection. If a user is disconnected from a party inadvertently, they will automatically be reconnected to that party without any user interaction. So I'm not sure what happened to you guys. Every once in a while, um, people will start dropping from parties or like one or two people would drop from a party for no reason. I guess Xbox is going to realize that you were playing with these guys. They dropped out and they'll add them back into your party just by them myself, which is excellent because during a match, I don't know, plenty of times I've been trying to get somebody back into a party and 20 seconds later, 30 seconds later, I'm, I'm still at spawn because I'm trying to invite this person in because the game dropped them automatically. Ah, uh, that hat's horrible. I should have bought the fucking other helmet. Ah, uh, whatever. Um, let's see what are some more updates here. Oh, they said you're going to be able to see Xbox Live management. Gold member veterans. Been here long? Show it off. Anyone looking at your gamer card will now know how long you've been an Xbox Live gold member. And who knows, there might be other perks for you too. Thanks for sticking around. So I have been with Microsoft Live, Xbox Live forever. So I want to see where I'm at. Um, let's see, my gamer card. Where's my gamer card at? All righty. This is new bishop. Let's see, here we go. Let's see how long I've been around for. Five years. I'm up there, baby. And I think I've been almighty for five years. I wonder if they count getting my name changed. Even though it was the same account, I just changed my name from one thing to Almighty Machi to just Almighty. Because I had Xbox Live pretty much, I say, about three months after it came out with, I think, Unreal Championship was going to be the first game that um that I played on Xbox Live that, oh my god, I killed that game. Dedicated servers made by Epic 10 years ago. And why can't they, not 10 years ago, but why can't they have that now for Gears of War? It's mind-boggling. So uh, that's another improvement. Um, subscription notification. If your Xbox Live subscription is about to run out, you will be notified. So no more logging in and, oh shit, I can't play. What's going on? Um, let's see, account recovery. Many changes have been gone into account recovery. Um, damn it, where the hell did she go to? Um, where the hell is it? Uh, to speed up and increase reliability and people are still getting their accounts hacked by by kids just calling up and asking question after question after question so they get enough information and fucking hack your account which it happened to pro players it happens to just anybody who who maybe they don't like and they really need to tighten down on fucking security we're getting your account hacked because that's bullshit like people spend years and years and years on their account and just to have it stolen and everything changed and you know what i'm saying just the bullshit of that it, it shouldn't be happening now just, I don't know, they should have enough uh, security watch so that shit doesn't happen. Um, I guess there was video display issues that they were having, and they're going to be a bunch of HDMI connection upgrades, and um, it's going to override the audio and or video formats independent of display capabilities. So I guess if you were having issues with the way your video looks, there's an update coming for that. Um, you're going to be able to rate stuff. Like, if I go into one of my games, let's see, game library. Um, let me see, since this is a downloadable game, I go here. Right here, you're going to be able to rate this game. Um, and I guess people, I'm going to give it five stars. Let me see, is that, 